Hello and welcome to my channel. Today I'll show you how to uninstall XAMPP in Windows 10. If you have attained the purpose of installing XAMPP server on your computer, or if your XAMPP localhost server is not working properly due to some reason, then a clean uninstallation might be a good solution. It might look to you what a big deal to uninstall a software from the computer. If you do not uninstall your corrupted XAMPP server in a clean way, leave all leftovers, and then install a fresh copy of the XAMPP server, you may encounter the same or a new error again. To avoid future errors, we must uninstall XAMPP server completely from our Windows machine. In this video, I will show you how to completely uninstall XAMPP server from a Windows 10 computer. If you want to know the best way to install XAMPP WordPress locally on your Windows computer, then you can watch the end screen video for the complete tutorial in the easy steps. Now without further ado, let's get started. To uninstall the XAMPP server from your Windows PC completely, I have provided a few simple run commands for you, the link given in the description. Now, open the link in a new browser window, and copy the first command. In order to run the commands, press Windows plus R to open the run box. Paste the command you want to run, and then press the enter key. Now, under the programs option, click the uninstall a program link. Next, select the ZAMP application from the list. Then click this option. Now, it will ask for confirmation to uninstall ZAMP. Simply click yes to proceed. Now again, if it asks for a final confirmation, simply click yes. Next, it is asking if you want to remove the htdocs folder as well. Click yes. Now, the uninstallation process has been started. As you can see, our XAMPP server uninstallation has been successful, but a few components which include the registry, temp files, folder files, etc., remain on our Windows 10 computer. To completely remove all XAMPP server components from the computer, we must first restart our Windows computer, and then run the remaining command. After your Windows computer has successfully restarted, run the next command as earlier. Be aware that you must run the relevant command according to your XAMPP installation drive. For the time being, I have installed XAMPP on C drive, so I will run this command. Now, delete the leftover XAMPP folder from your drive. Now run the next command. Now select and delete everything in this folder. If only a few are not being deleted, skip them all. Now run the next command and repeat the previous step. Now that we have successfully deleted all the leftover files and folders. For the registry, it is already deleted during the uninstallation process by XAMPP uninstaller, so we don't need to delete them manually. Folks, I just want to tell you that, please like and subscribe, it will only take you 2 seconds, and if you are facing any problems, please let me know in the comment down below. Thank you so much for watching, I will see you next time.